Mr. Ikeda's Journey Three. The first character Shi of Shi Zi, a lion, means teacher or mentor. The second character Zi means child or disciple. The lion represents courage, dignity, youthful passion and resolve, which frequently appears in Nichiren's writings. Mr. Ikeda encourages everyone to persevere and triumph in all circumstances. 1950 to 1953, cultivating wisdom at Toda University. Soon after Mr. Ikeda joined Nihon Shogakan, a publication company managed by Mr. Toda, he was given the responsibility to edit for a children magazine called Boys Adventure. Mr. Ikeda, at the young age of 21 at that time, was appointed as the chief editor. The magazine was soon renamed as Boys Japan by Mr. Ikeda, out of the impulse to instill new hope in the life of children who will pave a brighter future for Japan. At that time, Mr. Ikeda would ask renowned novelists and artists to write and draw for the magazine. In addition, he started writing the biography of Johann Heinrich Pestalozzi, the educator, using his pen name Shinichiro Yamamoto. However, that was the early post-war era where society remained chaotic and life was difficult for many people. In an instant, the small publishing company like Nihon Shogakan had reached a deadlock. The publication of Boys Japan had also come to an end. Ushering in the new year, January 1950, Mr. Toda started on new business endeavors, but nothing seemed to be successful. During that time, Mr. Ikeda had a wish to resume his night classes at a college. However, he had no choice but to give up on schooling, as he had to work day and night to help with Mr. Toda's business. Mr. Toda said, "I'm sorry for causing you so much hardship. In exchange, I will take on the responsibility of becoming your personal tutor or teacher." Not long afterwards, Mr. Toda began the one-to-one -one lesson with Mr. Ikeda at his home every Sunday. These were later known as lessons at Toda University. The study materials were same as those textbooks used in universities, and Mr. Toda would wholeheartedly teach everything to Mr. Ikeda in a strict and serious manner. Today, Mr. Ikeda has received close to 400 honorary academic awards from universities around the world in recognition of his wisdom, which was cultivated at Toda University. However, The days of intense struggles continued for both Mr. Toda and Mr. Ikeda. Due to his business failures, Mr. Toda had to step down from his position as general director of the Soka Gakkai. In January 1951, Mr. Ikeda was called by Mr. Toda to his house. Mr. Toda firmly said, "If something should happen to me, I'd like to entrust everything to you. My mission in this world." Will be your mission too, Mr. Ikeda. Looked straight into Mr. Toda's eyes and answered, "Sensei, please rest assured. No matter what, I would pave the way for Mr. Toda to become the Soka Gakkai president." With that strong determination in mind, Mr. Ikeda chanted relentlessly and fought with his whole life. Finally, on 3 May 1951, winning over all obstacles. Mr. Toda was inaugurated as the second president of the Soka Gakkai. On that occasion, he declared, "I will, through my own efforts, achieve the goal of 750,000 member households in my lifetime." At that time, there was only one true disciple who took this great vow of his mentor to his heart. This person was Mr. Ikeda. On 2 January 1953. The day on which Mr. Ikeda turned 25, he was appointed as First Corps YMD Chief by Mr. Toda. This day marks the birth of a young leader of Kosen Rufu. To be continued, translated from June 2018 Kibo Journal, the Sokagakai Monthly Newspaper for the Junior Division.